Hi guys, just Safi here. Welcome to my channel. Today's video is an exciting video because we are doing a review of the Pattern Beauty Stronghold Gel. And this is what the product looks like. I bought the travel size because I wanted to test it out to see if I liked it before I purchased a big one because it's expensive. So we are going to get into this review and see how I like it and if it works on my hair. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button below and become a part of the MVP family. I post twice a week and you don't want to miss out on all the great reviews. And definitely, let's get ready to get started. Alright guys, let's get started. If you want to know about my microfiber towel, it is from the Alexa collection. I have a discount code, which I will put down below. Purchase her products. She's a fellow YouTuber. I'll also link her channel. She's an amazing YouTuber. Amazing person and... I'm just glad that I have the opportunity to work with her. All right. My hair is freshly washed and deep conditioned. And I also did my rice water treatment in my hair. And this is my hair with no product. It's super soft. I use the main choice Amazonia. Excuse me. Amazon hair collection. Um, shampoo and deep conditioner and yeah I'm really loving how my hair looks and feels okay I'm gonna go in first before I start with my products and I'm going to just use my castor oil and just massage my edges because you know I had a setback so I gotta work on these edges Let's see so I'm just going to to do that, do my edges first, do the back, the nape as well, and just massage that in. Then I'm going to go in with my leave-in. The leave-in that I'm using is the TGIN Green Tea Super Moist Leave-In Conditioner. And I've used this before on my channel, and I already did the test to see if these products mix well, and it did, so I'm very happy with that. And I'm going to go in, and I'm going to wear my hair a little bit different than I normally do. So, this time I'm going to go in, and I'm going to try to style with a bang, and see how that works. We'll see how that works. I will let you know if I like it or not. And what I'm going to do is, before I give you my final results, in the end, I'm going to do a wear test and wear it for the first couple of days. And then come back and give you a full review. Because I want you to be able to know, do these two products really work for the long term? Yeah, it may have looked nice after I styled it. Yeah, after I let it dry for the first day. But is it going to continue to do me right? So We're going to see, Tracy. We're going to see. So my hair is sectioned. My hair is wet. But I do have my spray bottle handy if I need to add more product and more water, excuse me, to my hair. And usually I'll add my leave-in in the shower, but I just didn't do it this time. If you hear noise outside, sorry, my neighbor's kids are out in the backyard. Alright, so there's my leave-in. Let's go in with the gel. It has a very plant-like smell. It's medium consistency. I don't know if you can see that. Let's see how it works into the hair. Hmm. 
Mm. Now, with this product, I haven't watched any other reviews because I didn't want it to in any way sway me. You know, one way or another. So, this is a really raw review. Let's see. So far, so good. So far, so good. So far, so good. All right, let me take my water bottle and just spray just a little bit. Because my hair dries up really, really quickly. And now I'm going to go in once again with my leave-in especially focusing that leave-in on the ends making sure that is penetrating through my strands and on my hair alright let's go in see hmm my curls are clumping so that's a good thing hmm it like I said it is mixing well with the leave in so that's a good thing hmm I don't know I'm kind of liking what I'm seeing so far, but I have to wait because I can't give final results. Can't give a final review until it dries and I wear it because the next day is always the test for me. So, so far so good. Now, this as well as the other styling products are as Tracy Ellis Ross who is the creator of the Pattern Beauty line she says here that they are free of parabens SLS color safe they're silicone free um, they're phthalate free and formaldehyde free so for all of you who follow the curly girl method or just are a stickler on the ingredients you put in your hair then you are well informed let's see so so far so good I can't complain as of yet I kinda am liking what I'm seeing and I like how it feels. It's not sticky. It's not sticky at all. So yeah. That's what we got. Day, I'm going to take this bonnet off and see what we're working with. This is how I 
tied my hair up last night. Very loosely, nothing tight at all. And then I have one in the back. I just shake my hair, fluff it out. I take the bang pieces and I just Take my fingers and stretch them down. And so far, so good. Sorry if you hear some noise in the back. My kids are home. But this is what it's looking like so far. So, this is what I have so far. I'm going to take this piece and I'm going to take a little bit of the gel if I can open it a little tiny bit of the gel and just add that just to any of the little frizzy spots just at the ends and not at the root because I don't want to bring the hair back up at the root. Right. I'm going to go in and take my blow dryer on low and just stretch some of these sections. I'm looking to the side because I'm looking at my mirror. So if you see my eyes over there, it's because I'm looking at the mirror. But all right, so far so good. I'm gonna come back tomorrow and stretch it one more time take it out show you just like i'm doing now and then i'm going to give you my final thoughts i wanted to do a thorough review for you so i will be back tomorrow with my final final thoughts but so far so good Am I impressed? I think I am. I think I am. I think I am. So we will see tomorrow. Peace out. Alright guys, let's get into my final thoughts about this 
product the pattern beauty stronghold gel I like it I do like it a lot I feel that it really did give me a hold for my hair and it gave me the hold that I desire because I like a little bit of a stronger hold and yeah my hair is frizzier now voluminous but I really like that so I really like how the product performed it was easy to apply to my hair and another thing that I liked is I was able to use it with my current leave-in and that's super important you know for me because I have so many different leave-ins I like my stylers to match with my leave-ins so this is what my hair is looking like these are what my curls are looking like my hair doesn't feel dry I washed my hair Thursday Friday you saw me refresh it and then you saw me refresh it again today and this is what it looks like and I'm really loving my results I'm loving how it feels and I really am happy with the product if I didn't say before I'm going to say it now and give you the specs really quick for this product it's paraben free free of SLS color safe silicone free phthalate free and formaldehyde free and this product does contain glycerin. Glycerin is the one, two, three, four, fifth ingredient. And the first ingredient is water. And I really like it a lot. So yeah, I'm very, very happy with my results. And it feels good. It looks good. It didn't dry my hair out, which was good. And it works well with my leave-in. I also I'm going to give you a side review of another product that I tried and this is the Sweetie's Choice Rich Dip Very Cherry 24 Hour Hold Biotin Infused Edge Gel. This is from Kiss Color and Care. This is their edge fixer. This is a maximum hold. And it comes in different flavors. And the one that I got was the very cherry. So let me just quickly open this up and show it to you. This is what it looks like. It looks like your typical edge controls it is very um, thick and it doesn't give you that greasy feeling which I like and I don't know how to feel about it though I've been using it for about two days I don't know necessarily how I feel about it um, I feel that it does work but I don't know the longevity of how it would work. I, I have to test it when I go out. But, you know, because of Rona, I ain't going nowhere. But it did hold when I was in the house. I didn't have any problems with it. It wasn't flaking. It didn't, you know, give me any problems with my other products that I've used my leave-in. And it didn't give me a problem when I used it in conjunction with the pattern and beauty gel so yeah I think it's a pretty good edge control I will be using it again because it has biotin in it and I want to use healthier products especially on my edges so yeah that's what it is and this is the review if you guys have any questions any comments let me know down below make sure you like and subscribe and I will see you guys next time.